homesteading to prepping to common horse sense, we are College Hill Farm. Welcome back to College Hill Farm. Well, today, uh, I'm trimming up this old honeysuckle bush. Got one in the back. I'm trimming up this old honeysuckle bush. Uh, it got on our TV antenna and broke the uh, end. Now, this is our TV antenna. It's made by OWN, O-N-N. -N. Uh, it says that it will do uh, 85 miles. Uh, we live about, well, let me put this up on the post and then we'll talk about it a bit. Electric tape, good for everything. Now, let's talk about that for a minute. Now, when we came here eight years ago, we got satellite TV. But our satellite didn't pick up a local TV channel. Uh, to the north here, we live about 50 miles north of uh, Lexington, Kentucky. So, or 50 miles south. So Lexington is 50 miles north of us. Thereabouts, 50 miles, give or take a mile or two. So, we wanted to receive a local TV channel. WKYT was our closest uh, local news. So, we took and went to Ollie's and bought this little antenna. I think I paid $39 for it when I bought it. It didn't come with no mountain hardware. I think. Walmart sells them for $59.95 right now. It's an ONN antenna, 85 miles what Walmart says. I think when I bought it from Ollie's, I think it said it was 100 miles, but it doesn't make much difference. Uh, 
I've tried it a lot of different ways. I initially mounted it on a big tall pole that's as high as the uh, high as the house. We've got a two-story house. It was high as the house, and it didn't make no difference to where I've got it mounted right now. I'm standing on the ground, and there's where the pole is. All I did was I drove in. This is just a seven-foot T-post. I drove in a seven-foot T-post and then put a, a piece of steel pipe up that was the same diameter as the, as the mount and just mounted it right here in the yard. Now, the only problem with that is I had this old bush here, this uh, honeysuckle bush, as a decoration bush for a foundation planting. It was here when we got here. Uh, I cut it back, but I haven't messed with it in about eight years. And it grew up till it broke the wire on my antenna. So I had to come out here and replace it. Now, with just this little antenna, Crystal and I get 30 channels. 30 channels. With new digital TV, each station has four to six channels. Okay? So there are five stations within 100 miles of me. And uh, each one of them gets that. Now, we're in Rolling Hills. Let me show you. Look right here behind me. See there? We're in Rolling Hills. We're not on top of a hill, but we are on a hill. And the antenna picks up just fine where it's at. I point it due north. It's about seven feet off the ground. It's not up to the roof of the second story, okay? It's about chest high. Uh, I would say you could mount this in your attic in the house and it would do just fine. Uh, it would be totally out of the weather and you could drop the wire right down through. Now it comes with a little amplifier. No antenna is going to get you any distance unless you got an amplifier on it. If my amplifier goes out, what am I going to do? Well, you can go buy a 20 or a 40 or a 100 uh, dB amplifier. Okay, dB stands for decibel. And your antenna itself will give you maybe 0.2 decibels worth of pickup. Okay? Uh, if it's no signal at the antenna, it doesn't matter how big your amplifier it is, it isn't going to make any difference. A decibel, 1 dB, amplifies that 10 times. Put up an antenna, uh, you're wanting to catch certain frequencies. The shape of the antenna, the distance, something called a dipole, and I'm not going to go into all that because that's a lot to go into. Uh, if you want to know more about that, Leave a question in the comments, and I'll do a video on creating your own antenna if you want to do that. But, you know, I taught that in college, so. But anyway, this thing is uh, good for 85 miles. We pick up a lot of TV channels with it, and it's just on a T-post right here in the flower bed. So, you don't have to have fancy stuff. Now, you can buy just uh, an amplifier. If you've already got an antenna or you find an antenna at a uh, at a flea market or something, you can buy that antenna, buy just an amplifier and do the same thing. So you don't have to expend tons and tons and tons of money. Uh, how much does this cost me to operate? Maybe two cents a year in electricity for that amplifier. Maybe. Uh, it beats that $127 a month that Dish was charging me. I cut Dish off just for the heck of it, just so you know. We quit using Dish because their prices just were too high. Too, too high. We watch internet most of the time, and uh, we use this for our news, our satellite, uh, to see about rain and storms and that kind of stuff. Uh, each TV station, a lot of them have just a satellite channel. That's the most awesome thing in the world. I can look at their satellite and know what's going on in real time. So, 
Now, if you like this stuff, this homestead, do-it-yourself kind of thing, be certain to come on out to the channel and subscribe. We do this homestead stuff every week, sometimes one, sometimes five videos. Just depends on what's going on in the homestead that week. Now, if you hit the little bell when you come to the channel, it'll be right up here. It'll notify you when we upload a video. We upload on Sunday, Tuesday, and Thursday. Now, it's time for me to haul off some brush and get on to the next thing.